You got to want more. I tell you. Be patient with me. Walk with me. As you listen to this audio, no matter where you at, whether home, in your car, in your office, your study room, your man cave, woman cave, wherever. Somebody gonna feel me. You gotta want more. Don't settle. Don't be closed minded. When you have rejection or things don't go your way, don't stop. When you don't get the results, when you put in that application and don't get that call back, or when you start that business and only have like three, four customers a day, and your business is in the red because you're losing more than you spending more than you making. I see it all the time. How many restaurants you've seen come and go? How many businesses you've seen come and go in the hood? You gotta want more. That spot that you in right now is not your grand finale. It's not your ending. It's not your celebration. It's not your ending. You still have chapters left to create. You're still amongst your story. Somebody feel me. Let's get back to that adjustments. Let's get back to that switching lanes and trying and experimenting and getting out that comfort zone and trying. Make some failures tomorrow. Make some mistakes. Learn from them. Live in it. Spend that extra money for advertisement or just branding. Get that logo. Buy that equipment. Start that lawn service. Buy them a couple of lawnmowers you've been thinking or debating about getting this money forever that's maintenance somebody always gonna need that grass cut you got your eyes and your mind on the business but you thinking to yourself about how I cannot work so much to where it discourage you and you don't try as you wrapped up in your emotions and thinking of how things could not work and what you don't have at the very moment to start. Reverse that. Think about the things that you do have to start. You got self. You got social media. Use it as a tool to gain and talk to an audience instead of Scrolling for gossip and conversation and getting distracted about pictures and who's with who and what drama is going on. Think of how it can work when you start it. Think about how them two customers can turn into four if you treat them right. If you respect them and call them by name and 
build a rapport. Just a simple thank you go a long way with a lot of business and life and interactions to make things better as some don't know. You ever wonder why people who are already rich get richer? People who got money make more money? You ever just wonder why? Same thing the poor people do. They want more. Having things is a mentality. Being rich is a mentality. It's a thought. I'm not rich on paper, but I'm rich mentally. Because I want more. And I believe more is coming to me. And I'm walking in my path. I'm rich already. Rich off my mindset of clarity and working on that even more. That's rich. It's people that win the lottery and lose it all. It's people that get lawsuits and lose it all after a couple of years. Because they have a poor mentality. They have a poor mindset. They come across some money that should be gone in a couple of years because of the, of, the, of the mindset. It happens. They got a TV show about that shit, about how people to win the lotteries and stuff and these royal... Royal towns and places and still end up broke after multi millions of a lump sum having it happens. Being rich is a mindset, a mind state. Being healthy is a mind state. Gotta want more. And that's the message for today. I hope you work on that. Rap talk.